Let's move to reference levels displayed when saving from DGN to DWG. And specifically, we're going to be talking about when the levels of the reference file are the same as they are in the master file. Now, there could be a problem with saving DGN files to DWG file format where the level display might be different. Now, your two options are either to retain the reference file or to merge that reference file into the master file, and then uh, you just have one DWG file. And we'll, we'll see this in the demonstration video uh, shortly. Now, retaining a reference attachment as an attachment is just as it sounds. It means that the master file gets converted and the references get converted, and these files are all saved in the same location. Now, merging a reference file is a different animal because you're now taking a file and you're merging it into one output. And this is oftentimes where users will report to us that levels that were certainly that were once on or off are now on when they shouldn't be or off when they shouldn't be. This is termed as the level mass setting or the level on and off setting. So these are some common issues. We're going to be looking at three different scenarios. Scenario number one is where a DGN file has an external reference file with an external nested reference attachment that all share levels in common. And our second scenario will be saving a DGN file that will be merging our reference file. And as I mentioned, this can be more problematic. For example, saving a DGN with a reference attached and external nested attachments change when the files are all merged together. And in our third scenario, we'll see saving a DGN file with a sheet model with a self-attachment of the design model, which is very common, especially if we're emulating the viewports that you can have in a DWG file when open from AutoCAD. So in most of these scenarios, these are generally not a problem. However, we in the support team have commonly had users report that the level mask or level on off state is not correct. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like and share it with others. If you want to see more like it, please consider subscribing to this and Bentley's other channels. Thank you and see you next time.